Hi, welcome to Bedtime Reviews, where I review random items because I can't sleep. Uh, for years I've been using my Dell laptop, which has a fingerprint reader, compatible with uh, Windows Hello. Uh, this made it super easy and convenient for me in terms of uh, logging in. I mean, for those of you who don't know what Windows Hello is, well, Windows Hello is it's a biometrics uh, based technology allowing users on Windows 10 to sign in securely uh, to their devices. Not only that, you also have secure access to your apps, you know, networks and online services with uh, just a fingerprint or facial recognition. This is considered to be more secure than the traditional password. That's because, you know, to have a secure password, uh, it has to be at, at a very long with an array of characters to make it hard to guess and it shouldn't be reused you know nowadays with the average user having so many accounts that means so many complicated passwords to juggle and that's hard to remember really uh, hence people tend to use either easy to guess passwords or one password for many accounts or write them down um, the issue with uh, facial recognition is uh, it automatically attempts to log you in whenever it's presented with a face. If it recognizes your face, it will log you in or unlock your screen, uh, creating a security risk if you want, you know if you wanted your computer logged for whatever reason at that particular time. Um, with a fingerprint reader or sensor, you have so much control. Is you only log in or unlock your screen when you actually want to. Enter the Acnight USB fingerprint reader for Windows 10 Hello. I picked this uh, fingerprint reader from Amazon for $22.99 uh, with Prime meaning it was delivered the next day. In terms of looks, it uh, complements my PC beautifully. It does protrude a little bit, about a centimeter. However, in terms of looks, it looks quite nice plugged in at the front of my PC. Uh, if you don't want it pl uh, plugged in at the front, you can always get maybe a desktop uh, USB extension if you do not want it plugged in the front, or maybe your PC doesn't actually have USB ports at the front. You know, not all PCs, uh, PCs are built uh, equally. Uh, setting up was easy actually. It was a case of plug it in and Windows automatically install the required drivers. From then on you go to your settings to register your fingerprint. Dead easy. Uh, by the way, you can store up to 10 fingerprints. The reader also has 360 degrees uh, fingerprint detection, making it easy for you to sign in at any sort of uh, awkward angles as well. I mean, it's also lightning fast with way over 97 plus accuracy rate for me. In terms of durability, this little beauty is all metal for the outer casing, undoubtedly increasing durability. I've been using this reader on a daily basis for over a month now since I purchased it with no issues whatsoever. I mean, I know it's too early to tell, however, looks wise, it does look like it's well built. But only time will tell. Uh, in terms of value for money, I would say at $22.99, I would say that's reason, uh, reasonable in terms of build quality and what this thing gives you, which is valuable protection that a lot of us take for granted until maybe one day you are one of those unlucky ones and you have your system or where still your identity is compromised due to sloppy practices. In my opinion, this little gadget is definitely good value for money. If you like my review, give me a thumbs up and please subscribe. Until next time, take care.